JB here once again making a new video today Sunday April 5th not a very nice day I'm gonna go out with my car right now just want to make a video we got these things going on here this is in front of my, well, the entrance of my building, Princess 7, Code Virtu. I got these papers going on about the COVID-19, about the virus. Then they have this thing here. Anyways, there and there. I'll go down to the car now. Here too, in front of the elevator, they got these going, these papers. How to wash, how to wash your hand and clean your hands. How to properly wash your hands anyways. It. all the precautionary tales all the precautions you should take to avoid getting this virus check out this painting you like it and over here, there's another art thing. I don't know what, looks like some Mayan thing. I don't know what that is. Whatever it is, I don't know. Let's go to my vehicle. So exactly a week ago, the starter motor on my Mini Cooper here just died. And I was left stranded luckily i wasn't too far from home so i'm getting i'm getting the starter out of the car right now find me some light that's the starter right there so that's the starter motor this is what starts your car this is what starts your engine your car this little thing here that looks like a bullet so this from here to here there's an electric motor and this part the upper part here the little baby part here you see it's called a solenoid this is the solenoid you see Quiet, please. Trying to make a video. That's the solenoid. And this is the actual starter, so if you can see that. And over here, there's a gear. They call that a Bendix gear. So this kind of works in two phases. That gear pops out to over here. That's not working very well, is it? See it. Like this see that gear? Anyways, it's dark in here. I can't explain how a starter motor works, but anyways, uh, the solenoid makes that gear move forward into the outer casing, and then that gear touches to the flywheel of the car. And then it turns the flywheel of the car. The flywheel is attached to the crankshaft. And then turns the motor over, turns the engine over, and it's, that starts the engine. That's how your engine starts. Unfortunately, it's really dark in here. Anyways, I'm gonna leave it, keep it here for now. Keep it out of the car.
let's go for a ride. And this time the car's gonna start. The, the starter is not a remanufactured one, it's actually a brand new one, supposedly brand new one for the price of a remanufactured. So it was about 300 bucks or something like that. I can start the car without putting the key in the slot here. I'm supposed to be able to. Yeah, there you go. Hear that music? The bus driver just dropped. <laughs> the bus driver next to me dropped a, a can of some of something of sorts. I don't know what it what it is.
Romanoft. I used to live there. That's where we used to live. Camera looks crooked. 